Absolutely. What about uh, your first game? Let's take us through that. Uh, I thought it was pretty neat. I didn't really know what to expect as far as like the game speed. I kind of had an idea about our scrimmages, but everyone said it's a def totally different speed when when you actually get out there and going. But uh, I mean, a lot of the upperclassmen helped me get through like the calls and the checks and things. So was, I was able, to, I guess, play a little easier because I knew like I was I was right on the calls because they would kind of. If I did something wrong, they were corrected, so I was pretty, pretty happy about that. Uh, what's it like being a, a true freshman and starting your first game here? Um, I think it's definitely neat. I mean, I was didn't really know what to expect, whether I was going to get redshirted or, uh, or actually play, but uh, I guess some guys got nicked up a little bit, so I had to kind of step in. And what did you think of playing in front of uh, the home crowd at alumni? In the first I thought game? it was pretty neat. I mean, I wasn't used to that many people. It was kind of, it was kind of neat to see that many people in the stands. Like, the student section was pretty wild with the whole C, like, I guess. Um, Cool. So it was pretty, pretty cool. Yeah, you led the team tackles yeah. mm -hmm. the first day. Uh, did you anticipate having such an impact? Like no, that? not really. I didn't really. I didn't really think. I, was, I don't know how much I was going to do, but the defensive line really kind of ate up the interior like offensive alignment, so it's kind of easier to run around a little bit. Right, and uh, because it's such a, an impact, what are your goals going forward for the rest of the season? Um, I guess just to do my best on like whatever I do. I mean, just make the my first, first, my first goal. I guess is to. Make sure I set the defense correctly as far as like where everyone's supposed to go because that's surely the most important thing. So, what kind of thoughts or emotions were going through your head as you took the field for the first series on the Northeastern? Oh, I was I was just excited. I was excited to get back on the field. It's been about a year and a half since I actually playing the game, so I was just really excited. Had a little jitters, but it wasn't too much. So I just knew out there. I knew I had to go out there and lead the team. And I was excited because it chose my chose me to go first and start the game off. Uh, how would you evaluate your performance in Saturday's game? I feel like I did pretty well. There's different things I could have done better, but uh, <clears throat> there wasn't. I didn't really get too many snaps. I only played about a half. So I'm looking. I'm looking forward this week to get a little more playing time and just see how everything goes and just really fill everything out and do a little bit better. Uh, what was your reaction when Coach Spaz named you the starter for the Northeastern game? Oh, I was excited. I was really excited. I had a. I worked hard this summer. Worked hard this winter. And I just feel like I put myself in a position to be that guy, and I'm just ready to lead this team in however way that must, however way it's going to be, and I'm just excited for my role in this team. Who was, uh, who was the first person you told when uh, Coach Spaz told you this time? I, I, I just called home, told my mom, told my dad, and then they were just happy for me because they know I've been, I've been working hard. And so they're really my biggest fans. My, it's my supporting cast right there, so I just told them first. Okay. Um, what road stadium are you most looking forward to play in this season? Um... I don't really want to look too far ahead, but I'm just ready. I'm ready for all the road games. I've never really played anywhere like playing like Clemson, Virginia Tech, all those stadiums. Clemson, Notre Dame. Very, yeah, Notre Dame, <laughs> exactly. Clemson's close to my house, so I know a lot of my family members are going to be able to come to that game, so I'm excited about that. Good. Um, what's your biggest pregame ritual? I just like to get away, just relax. I can't. I don't really want to just get too get too amped up for the game. So I like to just get away, just relax, get my mind right, just think about my assignments. I know I'm going to get excited once I touch the field, so I don't want to be too excited when I get out there.